I always look forward to our weekly session every week at this time. And today and this week, I was really looking forward to it. Usually, I'm looking to pick a topic to share with you to help you with your lives. And I talk a little bit about my family and myself, but I don't talk a lot about myself. And today, I'm going to share a personal announcement with you. So I'm really excited about today's session. I want to thank everybody for joining us. Whether you're joining live, thank you for being here with me. Whether you are joining uh, on replay, thank you for being here with me. Again, I am so excited to see people here. Uh, and I want to thank you for being with me, especially for this session. Uh, and as you know, I always have topics. I'm always gearing and attending to your needs and thinking, what can I share? What can I give you that will help enhance and elevate your needs and your goals? And I'm thinking about what I can do for you. And I don't really talk a lot about myself. Uh, I talk a little bit about my family. But today, I'm going to give you a big personal announcement. So again, I want to thank people for joining in today. Uh, if you are here, again, I want to thank you. So please, if you are here, put a comment in the chat so I can know you were here. I don't always know pe if people are here unless I see a comment from them in the chat, from you in the chat. I'd love to be able to be grateful and appreciative. So whether you're here live or whether you're here on replay, put something in the chat to let me know that you're here. Uh, say hello to everybody, or hello to me, hello Dr. Ellen, or tell us happy Sunday, or tell us something about your day. I'd love to know who's here with me today. And I'm really excited about people joining today. Um, so I am delighted you are here with me. Um, how did I do on my necklace today, by the way? I always search a special necklace that will go with whatever else I'm wearing. Sometimes I pick my glasses specially also. And this is just such a fun necklace. Uh, so let me know in the chat also what you think of this necklace today. Sometimes I pick my necklaces uh, because of the color sometimes because of the texture or the 3D or something about it, sometimes because of the shape. And this necklace is one of my favorites because it has everything. It's got color, texture, 3D, the shapes. So I love this necklace. I wanted to pick this today and share this today with you. Um, and again, I have a special announcement. Usually I'm sharing topics for you. So we are a full scope group for motherhood and busy, busy, busy women. Uh, and so sometimes I'm talking about work-life balance. Sometimes I'm working about talking about how to help you reach goals in your life and reach success. Sometimes I'm helping you cut stress or learn time management techniques and strategies or helping your kids get through milestones. Uh, like sleeping through the night, or sleeping in their own bed, or toilet training, or helping around the house. Remember that one. I even had a song with you for that. Uh, or building a better relationship with your partner or spouse or other people in your life. Sometimes it's handling multitasking or taming that heavy load of tasks or creating better boundaries in your life. And I've shared lots, I've been on lots of phone calls with you individually. I've helped you with programs on many of these topics. And so today I'm really excited that you are here for me. And I'm really appreciative and thankful and grateful. So again, I'm going to ask you to put something in the chat so I can know for sure you are here. I don't always know. I'd love to know. and be able to thank you um, and think of people individually to thank. So now for my announcement. I've talked about my family to some extent in the group and I've mentioned my daughter 
So my wonderful daughter, Lori, is 30 years old. She will be 31 on July 29th, coming up very soon. Uh, and she is married for a few years. Uh, she has a wonderful husband, my son-in-law. And I've seen her through all of her stages growing up from infancy and when she was a toddler and going to school, teenage years, the college years. Uh, she even went to law school and graduated from law school and she's a lawyer. And so my daughter has gone through really all the stages of childhood and is now an adult. And here is my announcement that I've been waiting to tell you. So my daughter is pregnant and that means I am going to be a grandma. I'm going to be a grandma for the first time. I am so excited. I'm going to be Grandma Ellen. And I am so excited to share that with you, our community, because I really think of our community like a family. We are here for each other. I'm here for you, you are here for me now. And so here's where you invo you're involved. Um, and as I mentioned, I usually come here with topics for you about work-life balance or reaching goals or happiness in life, how to be successful in life, how to create your best life. Sometimes I'm talking about creating better boundaries, um, lots of different topics, how to handle all of the things on your busy plate. So I always give advice to you. And here's what I would love to do as a community. I would like to ask you in our community to share your favorite tips for new mothers. Um, what's your best advice for new mothers? I'm going to ask you to share that uh, in our group during the week. Uh, you're welcome to put it here also. I'm going to collect all of that and bring it to my daughter and let her know. I think that would be a lot of fun for her to hear the advice that you in my group can give to her. Um, so what's your favorite advice to new mothers? Uh, and it could be one piece of advice or if there's a couple, couple of things, you can't narrow it down if you wanna write a few things. Uh, please feel free to write what you're comfortable with. I am grateful and appreciative and I know you will come up with some wonderful things um, you're welcome to come up with the serious topics that I talk about. Uh, if you have some funny advice that you'd like to post, um, that is fine too. Uh, any ideas about cutting stress or handling relationships or multitasking when that happens or time management or something about nursing or handling diaper rashes or what's your favorite advice for new mothers? I can't wait to see what you are going to write. I am so excited. I'm going to be Grandma Ellen. Uh, my daughter's due date is August 15th. So about a month from now, I will be a grandma. Um, I may try to also post two videos in my group that I made for my daughter and our family. Um, she asked me to create a gender reveal video for our family when she found out the gender, which I did. Of course, it is a singing video. Those of you who've been here know I come up with songs and I use songs and music. So that is a singing video. And I also created a crazy grandma to be Ellen video, which my friends and my family and my daughter and son-in-law all think are very funny. So. I will try to post that in our group as well. Um, I am working on a grandma song, which I don't have completed yet, but when I am finished with that video, I will post it uh, in our group. So um, I am so delighted again that people are here. And again, for those of you who might have tuned in a little late, Again, I am so happy to welcome you here and to share my personal announcement with you. And that personal announcement is, and I've spoken about my daughter in the group, 
My daughter is 30 years old now and she's married for a few years and my daughter is pregnant. So I am going to be a grandma, Grandma Ellen. And I am so excited about that. I am so excited to share that with our community, with our group, because you are like a family to me and I try to create this group like a family. So I am so dis dis delighted to share my news with you. Uh, my daughter is due August 15th and I am just so excited and delighted and enchanted and entranced. And I see Eileen wrote, wow, congratulations, Dr. Ellen. Thank you, Eileen. I am so grateful for our family, our community being here for me. Um, as I mentioned, I usually come up with topics to share with the busy moms in our group. And I talk about work-life balance or reaching goals or becoming successful or elevating your level of happiness. All these different topics. And I think every week really carefully, what, what are we up to? What topic can I share with our group? And I love when you show up and I share these topics. And today I decided to share something about myself with you and I'm so grateful for people showing up for me. So again, I'd like to encourage you if you're here like Eileen did, please put something in the comments so that I know you are here because I don't always know who's here or not. And I am really grateful and thankful and appreciative that you are here. So I'd like to be able to see you and make sure that I know that you're here so please put a comment in our comments section, anything you'd like. And as I've asked, where you come in on this is I'm always giving advice and strategies and tips and cues to you. And I would like to collect from our community some advice. I'd like you to go into our group during the week. I, I am going to create a post and ask you, what is your favorite advice for new mothers? And I'd like you to post something. What is your favorite advice that you give to new mothers? Uh, it could be about handling all of the busy tasks that you have to do. It could be about multitasking. It could be about work-life balance. It could be about your relationship with your partner or nursing or going back to work or it could be whatever is on your mind. I would love to, to collect those tips that you have and I'm going to bring them to my daughter and I will tell her this is what our group came up with as our favorite tips for new mothers. And I'll probably put it together and share the combined uh, record of suggestions in our group. I am so grateful that everybody is here. Uh, whether you're watching this live or on replay, Please make sure you put a comment so that you are seen. Please go during the week to our group and give us some something about your advice for new mothers. Uh, again, it could be something serious, something practical, something realistic, something funny, whatever you come up with. It could be one thing or a couple of things, uh, whatever you think is useful. I would love to collect that and share that with my daughter. I am so happy to share this great announcement with you and this personal milestone in my family's life. I am so, so, so excited and glad to involve all of you in that as well. I will keep you up to date. I will be here every Sunday um, as we've been doing uh, at our regular time. And I will keep you up to date then and let you know as we're uh, getting closer. And I will keep uh, sharing my recommendations in the group as well. Uh, I have two videos that I may post. Uh, as I mentioned, my daughter asked me to create a gender reveal video when she learned the gender uh, of her baby. And I created that and I shared that with our family and friends. Of course, it is a video where I was singing. I sang something um, and my daughter and our community loved that. 
So I will share that in the group. And I also made a crazy grandma to be Ellen video, uh, which my friends and family think is funny. I will try to put that in group as well. So I'm really excited, so happy to share that with you. So happy that you are here with me. We are a family, we are a community, and I am so delighted to be in community with you. So I will keep you updated. Uh, please make sure you check the, our group during the week and that you will post some of your favorite advice. I will try to get those other videos posted so you can enjoy them hopefully as well. I will see you in the group during the week and back here again next Sunday at our regular time with another topic. And I will look forward to seeing you then and thank you all for your excitement. We are going to enjoy this together. So thank you for being with me and I will see you, let's talk again next Sunday and in the group during the week. Love you all.